How are we going to possibly give it one, just one prize out to this? You are going to talk us through some of the things that Junior is going to show us today. Just a little bit about getting around with a little bit of extra strength and helping us move easily. So over to Winston, you, you tell us what he's going to do. So is there something we can do to help us, Winston, when we're sitting? Just to strengthen that muscle a little bit, some legs, leg some, ups and downs, or I some, don't know the official term for that. But. Some quad extensions we could always do, as mm -hmm. Junior will demonstrate. There we go. Always go single leg, start with the one leg, keep the other leg as a base to keep you nice and balanced. That'll help strengthen the quad, the front of the leg above the knee. Does that actually help with the knee as well? Because I know I've got really bad knees, and I think moving that kind of keeps the, the knees flexible and loose. With arthritis, movement is always a great way to get rid of the pain. It's hard to move, but it's necessary to move. Yes, it will long-term help with the knees. If they tend to hurt already and the extension hurts, we uh, have a different demonstration. So just full extension, you keep the knee straight, and that will engage that muscle, which starts at the outside of the hip and works its way into the inside of the knee. So it cuts across the uh, quad. Now, one of the things that you're showing as we were just, you know, bending the leg in and out uh, before we go up to stand, not only is that good to help with movement, but it's also great to help with your blood pressure, normalizing blood pressure, getting your blood functioning and moving through your body when you've been sitting for a long period of time before you go to get up, because then what can sometimes happen is your blood pressure will drop, you'll feel dizzy, and you potentially could fall. Yes. <laughs> if, if you do happen to have a resistance band or a stretch band or anything flexible, you could always do external rotations with this as well. Or if you're Mrs. Camper, you have a nicely crocheted band, which she's just going to show you, I think, in a minute. So let's see it, Junior. So external rotations, just like the uh, dumbbell, only difference is we're using a different object. Sure. We're going to invite Mrs. Kemper up to show us her home. Can we have a round of applause? Yeah, for sure. This is lovely. Oh, oh, goodness. So Mrs. Kemper is stretching that, lifting her arms way high. No, I take a deep breath when I go up. Deep breath when she goes up, she says. My goodness, bending her knees. Awesome. Very stuff. well done. Wow. Thank Very you well so 